right, so I pulled two of my prints from the other day, and I'm going to make a little um, mixed media birdhouse piece on both of them. So I'm just using a stencil to put in the branch that holds the birdhouses, and I'm using the little house-shaped paint chips that I got. And I did this on both of the prints. I'm going back and forth between two of the prints from yesterday and doing two pieces, both with similar attributes. And now I'm going to jelly print the little houses a little bit just to add some detail and interest. Now I put the turquoise on the turquoise and kept it. When I put the turquoise on the yellow, I didn't like it, so I wiped it back, but it's not on camera. And it just left a real faint impression. And then this is the PBO pink blue and I did it on the green and again I wasn't real wild about the color combination so I blended it back out and just kind of lightened it and I put this on the red and I liked it I ended up covering most of it up so you don't see it in the end on both of these pieces you can see I'm just kind of blotting that down to make it less noticeable with just a damp baby wipe. And I decide to add some jelly printed napkin onto the birdhouses. And once this dries, you'll still see some of the color underneath kind of hard on the camera but you can in real life you sort of see the little shadows of it and on this one I added some stamp tissue in the turquoise and now I'm adding some of the black these are Martin houses and you can see the red one is over here I've adhered it with a bird to the left and I end up covering up that yellow with a blue because I just think it's too much of the yellow and I need a little pop of a third color and I'm going to do the same thing here put the nine Now the bird here I had um, cut out from a jelly print yesterday that I had done and I thought it was on camera but it wasn't and this is just some jelly printed uh, napkin that, with a chevron that was in turquoise and blue and I like it a lot better with that third color added in and I'm just trimming the bottom where I had a little overhang and just giving a coat over the I also stenciled through with uh, modeling paste to make the leaves. And this is just a little sticker in silver that says Home Sweet Home. And other than some shadows, this one and a signature, this one's pretty much done. And I'll work on the other one again. This time I'm using the Golden's Gel Medium because I think it works at adhering these little paint chips a little bit better. Less likely to curl up on the edges. And I'm going to trim a quote that I had 
already printed about family. And I decide that I'm going to trim it down and break it apart. And a lot of that cutting is off camera. All right, and I'm going to use a map, and I decided that if I placed it just right, there was a city that looked like the eye. So I'm just tracing it with the black pit marker, and then I'm going to cut it out. And I just added a little wing and a green map. And I'm going to give this a whole coat of the decoupage. And then I'm going to dry it so I can go back with the pit markers. So I'm just using a medium flesh. I wanted to bring that red across that pink. And I'm adding a little bit of gray just to add some definition to the wing. And then I'm going to go around underneath some of the houses and on the other page with the gray. And then I decide I'm going to use the pink around the word family, but I don't like it. So I decide to take it back off with a baby wipe and use the green and the aqua and blend it into the background and I like that a lot better. Now I do do the lower half of the quilt uh, quote in the pink and that doesn't bother me as much that it's not blended that it stands out. Kind of brings that pink across the page. And I'm going to sign them. And they are done. And then I come back with the coral color and just kind of minimize some of the tissue where it overlapped and it was white and add the shadows around the the birdhouse and under the quotes just to give it a little finishing touch well, that's about it thanks for watching oh i remember i wanted this branch to go over the house and so I added that back in.